The calendar shows we're only a month into fall, but that didn't stop a serious discussion today about treating state roads in winter. As Eyewitness News reporter Mark Hiller explains, what was discussed was aimed at making your commute safer. So this is going to impact, we think, the winter season. Pointing out a bend in the jet stream after recent snowstorms in the Rockies and Northern Plains, National Weather Service meteorologist Dave Nicosia laid out his northeastern Pennsylvania winter outlook at the Lackawanna County 911 Center. So what happens is you get a battle between these Arctic and polar highs coming down in the Bermuda high. Explaining factors of forecasting influence is all about getting PennDOT's engineering district four management team ready for the inevitable, treating and plowing roads when snow and ice eventually hit. Well, they need weather information for public safety as well to keeping the roads clear. So they're a partner of ours and we work very closely together in the winter time. Sometimes winter hits early and with a vengeance as we saw last year during a mid-November snowstorm. It crippled roads during the afternoon and evening commute, stranding drivers left and right. Lessons have been learned. Being more proactive than reactive, that's going to, you know, make travel a lot better for everyone and keep our motoring public safe. Even though Nicosia's expectation is we could be several weeks away from any widespread winter road woes, PennDOT isn't taking any chances. It has 15 trucks like this one with the plow already attached, ready to roll at a moment's notice, just in case. That number will ramp up by mid-November to tackle any troubles along 199 routes throughout Lackawanna, Luzerne, Pike, Susquehanna, Wayne, and Wyoming counties. There's storms that come in that, you know, they're going to take a lot more of our resources to fight. And again, um, having the staffing, having the trucks ready, you know, making sure we have all the materials on hand to, to fight those storms, that'll be key for our success. In Jessup, Mark Killer, Eyewitness News. PennDOT says because it may still have several more weeks before dealing with wintry weather, it plans to finish up summer projects in its District 4 region.